as he makes his way to bed. Yeah. Oh, we might have a little action here. You see uh, Rouser and Calverly chatting things up. Remember that hit that I was talking about? Wow. Someone might have to answer the bell here now. But Yeah, here we oh, go. Yeah, Kevin yeah. Spooner called it. Yeah. Someone's got to answer Jordan, the bell. two tough customers, Calverly and Rouser. Calverly getting the majority of shots in using two fists. And a heavy hit! Down goes Calverly as JR fires the shot instead of who shot JR. It's JR pulling the trigger. You don't mess with JR. He's on top puppy. Woo! One shot salute. Good night, Irene. Talking with former storm captain and incredible D man, uh, Jordan Rouser, number 27. Uh, just want you to talk, first of all, about uh, what you're doing now, where you are, and uh, your last season. I uh, spent last season at uh, University of Central Oklahoma uh, in the ACHA. We had a good year. We ranked fourth going into the national tournament. Uh, came a little short, ended up losing in the quarterfinals to uh, Davenport. But all in all, it was a pretty successful year. Um, this coming year, I'll be uh, going to Selkirk College in Castlegar, continue my education, and uh, continue playing some competitive hockey, and I'm really excited for it. Let's just talk a little bit about playing in an American college. What's the experience like there? It's not quite like Canadian schools. Yeah, you know, you go down there and it's, uh, it, it's a uh, really abundant with a lot of energy um, you know you're down there and everybody's really proud of uh, where they are They're, they've got a lot of pride in whatever school they go to and they show that in everything from uh, athletics to academics so I don't think there's really a comparison in, to Canadian school it's it's just it's really a great experience for anyone that has the opportunity to go down to an American uh, big time school and, and play the sport they love Yeah I understand you were talking about uh, where you're going this year you're going to Selkirk to play for the Selkirk Storm a number of Campbell River Storm players there. You'll be joining some old teammates. Yeah, I think uh, that was one of the big reasons going there. Still talking to Nathan Brown and Dane Feeney. They had a great year this year. They Obviously, did. they won the, the BCIHL provincial title. Um, they, they, they said had so many good things about it, so I think it's going to be a good fit. I'm going to be real comfortable with a lot of guys I know there. Obviously, myself, Dane, Nathan Brown, and then Russell Sanderson's also going there. So uh, uh, hoping... Russell was also at uh, UCO. Wasn't yeah, he? he was my roommate at UCO. Uh, we went down there together um, for from Camel River, and uh, I think it's going to be another good year for the two of us. You know, I talked to Gage Colpern a lot last season, and when he was talking about what it's like to be a captain, he used you as a role model. You were an incredible captain for the Storm. You want to talk about that run, that incredible run to Western Canadian Championships? Yeah, I know everybody says that uh, it, it was such a good year because we had such a good team, but I think it went a little bit further than that. We were we were a very close team. Obviously, we had a lot of skill, but we like to play for each other, right? It was good going into that dressing room and seeing, uh, you know, on any given night, 20 guys that I wanted to go to battle with. You know, everything from uh, the coaching to the organization itself, everything just came together and uh, it was a really special, magical run and uh, I'm so grateful to have been a part of that. Well, you know, you're not known for your goal scoring ability, but you got a beauty when it counted in that final game against North Edmonton. Yeah, it was uh, it was a good game. Uh, we, were, we were playing really well. We knew how, uh, how hard it was going to be. We were really excited and I still remember the goal of this day. I don't think I'll ever forget it. And uh, ho hoisting that cup and bringing it back to Campbell River was something I'll never forget. We've been talking with, you know him as JR, Jordan Rouser, former captain of the Campbell River Storm. Thank you very much, Jordan. Thank you so much for having me. Campbell River eagerly looking for a fourth. Sending pass directed in on goal by Jordan Rouser. Feeney has it along the corner. The Storm pressuring North Edmonton here as we enter the final five minutes of the second. Feeney. He gets Rouser's tripped up gonna there. Come all the way down in the slot again. He's right in front. Score! Jordan Rouser taps that one past Mandruziak. I'm not sure if any of the Red Wings saw Rouser trailing behind all the all the red jerseys. Sneaks it past, front, all the way from defense, right in front of the net. He pots that one. Storm up ahead, 4-0 in this gold medal game. 